know you guys. So this reading will be for Gemini. Gemini sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs, you guys. So let's see what we have going on. For my Geminis. Moving forward in love, Gemini, sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs. What do we have Gem going on for Gemini in their love life? Moving forward. What does it, you know, what don't Gemini see coming? We have temptation. So someone around you may be tempted to text or call you. Moving forward, I'm saying maybe that you guys stopped talking. It was miscommunication. Someone, I'm saying that you or this person is afraid to reach out, Gemini. But I'm saying someone tempted to, whether it is you or them. You could be dealing with a Scorpio or Capricorn as well, Gemini. Um, Sagittarius. I'm saying you're trying to protect yourself. Or this person trying to protect themselves from you, like, you know, from another failed connection. Clarify temptation for Gemini. We have new beginnings. Okay. So someone or you afraid to reach out. I'm seeing that if this person reach out, they tempted to, but I'm seeing that they, they, that they are holding back. There's a new beginning on the horizon, like... Once this per person reach out to you, there's a new beginning. I'm seeing a chance to start all over again. This taking a leap of faith, starting fresh, starting something new. Some say some of you guys could have had a petty argument, Gemini. Or you tempted to start a new beginning with someone taking a leap of faith. I'm seeing some of you Geminis are traveling soon. We have third eye, eye chakra. So, yeah. So, um, some of you guys listen to your intuition or listen to your intuition about this person. So, I'm seeing that maybe you feel like maybe you, some of you guys had dreams or will be having dreams about this person, like going on trips or starting a new beginning with this person because this person is really at home worried about you or they at work uh, work thinking about you should they reach out or not tell me more about gemini and their person moving forward okay now we have emotional loss so i'm saying letting go of the past you could be dealing with a cancer scorpio pisces letting go letting go of the past to embrace something new i'm saying the past wasn't like really serving you much, much any longer. So, you know, it's it's time to take this leap of faith or renew a connection because it's, this emotional loss caused a, a lot of pain for, for the both of you guys. Like I said, you could be dealing with a water sign or a Sagittarius or they have water placements in their chart. I'm seeing the situation. This person will make time for you. This person, I'm saying that um, this person has a lot going on. They have family going on. They have work going on. They have friends going on. Um, they just trying to balance out, you know, their life, you know? So I'm saying that this person wasn't talking to you in the past or the communication, like it started to slack. But this person is really trying to balance, balance out their life to come forward, to come towards you, and they will. Because they feel this emotional loss. This person don't want to lose you, Gemini. They don't want to lose you at all. So, yeah, so we have disruption. So maybe someone's heart is guarded, you know, or their heart will be guarded, or this is you. Your heart is guarded when they come back. It's like they tempted to right now as you're watching this reading, but they know when they do, there's a new beginning. But maybe your heart is guarded or theirs or it, it would continue. Their heart would still be guarded, Gemini. I'm saying that this person um doesn't trust very easily. But, I mean, it's going to take them some time because they will find everything to be balanced. So, let's, let's dig in deep. Let's see more. 
Tell me more about Gemini. Okay, something changed. Then I tell you guys, there's a new beginning. It's coming. New beginning. You can't make this up. Gemini, there's a new beginning on the horizon. So something changed. Look at this. Sagittarius energy. Oh, we have the justice here. So you'll be dealing with a um a Libra, you guys. Some of you guys could be dealing with a Libra. Okay. Um, some of you guys could be like going to court about this person. This is about kids. Some of you guys could have kids with this person or planning to have kids with this person moving forward. I'm saying a child is being taken on a trip. And some of you guys is taking a trip with this person in the future. Um, yeah. There's kids involved. Or someone want their child to come, Gemini. Sorry, you guys. I have to, um, there we go. Charge the iPad. Ooh. All right. So, we have justice here. So, something will turn out in your favor. Something is going good. Something is going well for you. Everything is, will, will be balanced right here because we have the justice card here, okay? Some of you guys can have Libra in your chart, Libra placement, Libra rising. Oh, we have the magician. This is you. I'm seeing manifestation. Like, I'm seeing, oh, everything is going well. Maybe you manifest this. Maybe you did some magic, like this, this new moon, like... It's giving you a push or it's giving your person a push, you know, wish fulfillment. Y'all, I keep seeing the Ten of Pentacles, like, trying to pop out. So, yeah. Some of you guys could be going back to a past person, like, they want you back or some of you guys could be experiencing new love. But everything will work out fine, Gemini. So you don't have to worry too much or worry any longer. If this person going to make a move, because they will make a move to you. Okay, we have a five and one. So um, we have here Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This talks about competitions. For some of you guys, they may feel like you're a bit flirt. Or you feel like this person is a bit flirt, okay? Like, nobody has time for that. Ooh, do you want me and only me? You know? Do you want me or do I have to compete? Mmm. That's deep. We were just going to good, baby. We won't got time to compete with no third party. Maybe this person had you competing. We had a five and one since. So, I'm saying like another person, Gemini, is looking, they out looking in on this connection with you and this person. So, Gemini, I'm, I'm seeing that your person made me move on. This is just a, like a new chapter and a new phase in their life, you know? Maybe they was dealing with someone who had a lot of options. Man, now this person want to come back in your life. They want to intervene. And your person already chose you. That's why they made everything balanced for you. So, you will get justice. Justice will be served. But watch out for third party trying to get your person. Like, baby, it's done. Let them know it's done. <laughs> Gemini. So, okay. So, clarify the Seven of Cups. This person maybe had to fight off their options. That's what I'm saying. This person had to fight off their options that they have for you. And they would do exactly that. Some of you guys could be dealing with a Scorpio as well. Yeah, look. Sagittarius popped out again. So, I'm saying that this person is finding out their options. Like, no, you can't take me bad. No, I'm good with Gemini. I'm going to move forward with Gemini. Yes, look. Look at this, you guys. I'm telling you. Yes, this talks, this talks about a new leap of faith, you guys. Jumping off the porch. Mm-hmm. This person is just like going through a healing. Like this person was going when you when you met this person, Gemini, they were still going through this healing mode, this healing method. But they're made up their mind. They it's done. Like whoever they was dealing with in the past is done. You could be dealing with a Leo as well. So this person is this person would take up for you. Yep. 
We had a nine of pentacles, so you could be dealing with a Virgo as well, Gemini. This person chose you. Um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. Yep. They, they chose you. Out of everybody, I'm saying that this person chose you. Like, this person don't want to live the single life no more. And if they did, do they do want to live the single life with the Nine of Pentacles? They want to have somebody by their side. Someone that they can build with to build towards stability, to build towards a relationship. So, I'm saying the talking stage, and they choose you. They want to see where you're headed, you know? Because they're knocking off all these people for you, Gemini. You cannot make this up. Yes, this person wants you. This person saying, yes, stop. So the answer is yes. Okay, you guys. All right. So this is this is the reading for the yeah, re reconciliation. This is the reading for um Gemini. Please like, subscribe, and share. And please, you guys, go shop in my bio, you know, in my comments. Like, I'm going to put the link down. Um, Please share this video, like I said. And, yeah, I have tarot cards and different other things on my shop. So, please go shop. And it's cheap. Yeah. Thank you.